Since the outbreak of COVID-19 two years ago, Southeast Asia may have finally gained some ground in its long battle against the virus, as growth forecast is expected to outperform last year's growth. Thanks to governments in the region relying less on lockdowns to stop infections while boosting vaccination numbers. This in turn, allows the private sector to get back to full capacity. However, this year's growth forecast for ASEAN takes into consideration some adverse spillovers from the virus resurgence in trading partners and the Ukraine crisis. In this episode, you're going to see this year's third quarter GDP growth rate of ASEAN's six economies. But before we move on, don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe to our channel for future updates. So, let's begin.